Sunday, another first alert action day, and you've probably noticed the extreme heat. If you've taken any step outside in Las Vegas the next couple last couple of days, yesterday we hit that all time heat record of 117, the fifth time we have seen that since records were kept. Uh, we also have that excessive heat warning and heat advisory lasting until tomorrow at 8 p.m. And we're starting to distance ourselves from records over the next couple of days. We could potentially tie or break or beat the daily temperature record today. That's 116 set in 1959. As we get to Monday and Tuesday, we're starting to see a couple of degrees between record territory and those daytime highs. But regardless, today, once again, we expect to be very close to that all time heat record. Here's a live look outside. We are waking up to mostly clear conditions right now and very warm conditions. Those temperatures right now in the mid 90s through a lot of the valley, 89 degrees right now in Pahrump and already 160 six degrees near Lake Mojave. So over the next six hours, we do see those wind speeds staying nice and light for us. We're nearing the triple digits as early as 9 a.m. And by 10 o'clock, we expect to hit that 102 mark. So 116 again, very close to the all time heat record, likely going to at least tie the daily temperature record with mostly sunny skies, still a 10% potential of seeing some showers. On top of that, we are looking at that very high UV index pollen forecast, low to medium, not too bad and air quality actually expected to improve today. We're looking at moderate levels after seeing unhealthy uh, conditions for sensitive groups. Now Mount Charleston going to stay in the 90s with some slight storm chances, 20 to 30 percent there. You can see Desert Doppler showing we do have some moisture uh, moving through the West Coast right now, and that could accumulate for Northwest Arizona once again as isolated thunderstorms and most likely going to see the west side of town, our local mountains, a better chance of seeing those showers. Now tonight we're hanging on to the triple digits once again through midnight, waking up tomorrow in the mid 90s. Those overnights really not giving us a lot of relief. Tomorrow we're cooling down just by a few degrees, 112 for that daytime high two degrees shy of that daily temperature record with partly cloudy skies expected because storm chances will be increasing tomorrow to 20%. That continues through Tuesday. Our temperatures grad local restaurants just racked up some big numbers. Problem is this is dirty dining and those numbers were demerits. 13 Chief Investigator Darcy Spears shows us customers are paying attention. Kelsey McFarland we hit that all time heat record yesterday afternoon. ABC's Karina Mitchell has the details. It continues to be competitive for companies to attract and retain workers. More business. One seventeen record once again. So here's what that means across the region up to 130 degrees for Death Valley. That is four degrees shy of the hottest temperature ever recorded on Earth. 120 for Laughlin and 109 degrees near Kingman spots like Overton up to 119. So it is going to be a scorcher across the board today. A lot of the West Coast dealing with this intense high pressure. Now planning out your day today, expect to see those triple digits as early as 10 a.m. and then we'll spike right towards 114 right around 4 p.m. hanging on to the triple digits likely until midnight. Now we are also watching the potential for a few isolated 